valve in the right camshaft cover and connect the canister purge solenoid vent hose. Next, position the positive battery cable harness on the right hand cylinder head. Install the bolt retaining the cable bracket to the cylinder head. Next, connect the purge solenoid electrical connector and the alternator harness to the junction block. Then connect the AC compressor clutch and HDR sensor. Install the water pump pulley and tighten the bolts to specification. Position the ignition coil brackets and ignition wire assembly onto the mounting studs. Install the seven nuts retaining the coil brackets to the front cover and tighten to specification. Next, install the two bolts retaining the ignition wire tray to the coil bracket on the engine and tighten to specification. Connect both of the ignition coils, condensers, and the CID sensor. Position the air conditioner high pressure line on the right hand coil bracket and install the bolt. Connect the ignition wires to the spark plugs. Be sure that the plug boots are fully seated and in the proper position as shown. Install the spark plug wire bracket onto the camshaft cover. Now, install the accessory drive belt. Install the wiper module assembly. Install the right upper cowl and the left upper cowl onto the vehicle. Install the weather strip seal and the wiper arms. Connect the fuel lines. Now, install the cooling fan and shroud. Install the air inlet tube. Next, connect the positive and negative battery cables and check fluid levels. Start the engine and check for leaks. This concludes this video presentation of timing chain replacement. Should any questions on procedures or specifications arise, please consult your shop manual. Early 1991 new model training.